Oh, that must have been the last crate. The goods transporter to the high boat can be switched off for now. And now I'm going to watch Cowboy Dodo for a while. Yoo-hoo! Hello! Oh, rats. Nobody there. I have the money. The five slots. No, no, I mean I have enough money to buy the nucleic acid. Impossible. Six slots? Well, I'll be. I didn't think that much money actually existed. Now I just have to get it out. Have fun! Yeah, I need that uh, cylinder with the uh, green fluid over there. The nucleic acid? A good choice. This stuff just came in. Yeah, I know. That was a mis- Actually, it belongs to me. Dream on, kid. I paid the five slotties for it. But I'd be glad to offer you a special price. Hmm. And it costs more money than there is in the entire sewers. Exactly. An unimaginable, unprecedented amount. Six slotties. I have the money. The five slotties? No. No, I mean I have enough money to buy the nucleic acid. Impossible. Six slotties? Well, I'll be. I didn't think that much money actually existed. Now I just have to get it out. Have fun! What happened here? Where's Gold? Can you spit us out? Already on our way. Well, at least nothing happened to the rest of you. But Usti! Excuse me, who? <laughs> I've never heard the name Usti before. Besides, I'd remember if there'd been a third brat. Believe me, you're all here. You and, uh, you know, who's it there? Uh, nah, it doesn't matter anyway. Much more important is, where is Gold? In the tunnel back there? Then she can't be far. Okay, you stay here with, uh, with, uh, you stay here. Don't you be too known? It's alone with an A. <laughs> Don't move! I'm coming down to save you!
It's so exciting right now. No time for walks. It's so exciting right now. It's so exciting right now. I worked hard for this, and I'm certainly not gonna toss. You, huh? Rufus, what are you doing down there? What do you think? I'm doing all the work. Ah, don't make me laugh. Yeah, and have you been able to stop Argus? I'm working on it. And you? Have you succeeded in making gold big again? Hey, I'm almost there. Well, give a holler if you need anything. From you, dream on. Yeah, maybe the other way around. Express cargo to Elysium. Recipient will pay shipping. Ahem. Hmm? Anybody there? Hello? What do you know? There's still one barrel left that's bound for Elysium. I'd better get that on its way, and fast. Although I do ask myself why the Elysian Bailiff would need an entire barrel full of leeches. Go! No! All right, hang in there, goalie. I'm coming. There. Now, this must have been the very last barrel. The bailiff will be happy. I had better report to him right away. That was disgusting. Disgusting, but it was worth it. I finally made my way to Ascension Customs, and I got rid of that old case of blood poisoning once and for all. So now, my way to the Ascension Codes is clear. This is where the Ascension Codes must be entered, but there's also a cartridge slot.
Ugh, Argus's dictaphone. Let's have a look, shall we? Memo. <laughs> Memo to, uh, self. The cartridge is in the safe. The combination is... <laughs> this is almost too easy. Four, four, three, seven. Uh-oh. There! Surrounded by idiots. All right, it's taken care of. Now I need to put on those silly clothes and get the cartridge. Da 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 da, cowboy dodo, cowboy dodo. Ah da 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 da. Rats, looks like I'm in hot water now, and I didn't get the safe combination either. Da 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 da, cowboy dodo, cowboy dodo. Ah da 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 da. Oh, great. Now I look a total twat. But I guess that was the plan. Which, by the way, is almost complete. Now I just need to fetch the cartridge from the safe. If only I could remember that stupid combination. Oppenbot! Are you cool? Ah! Intruder! Nonsense, you nitwit! It's me, Argus! I'm only wearing this grotesque outfit for invading Elysium! Oh, that's all right, then. Nothing is all right. We can forget the invasion if people keep losing my things for me. This time, my dictaphone's gone missing. Would you know anything about it? Well, I think I may have to check my memory for that. Then what are you waiting for? These annoying slip-ups are jeopardizing our success! That would arouse suspicion, and it wouldn't get me anywhere. Ah, I've got it. The dictaphone should be lying right behind you on the desk. You imbecilic lunkhead. I know that. Do you really think I buy Ulysses whiskers? Little by little, I'm going mad. It's as if that Rufus were contagious. You're dismissed, Oppenbot. Thank you, sir. And now... Oh, nothing? Don't tell me you're malfunctioning again, you filthy piece of scrap! Hello? Hello? Talk to me! Do you hear? Talk to me! Hello? The cartridge is in the safe. The combination is 4437. Blast! I knew there was a 7 in there. <laughs> He's got a little surprise coming. What the... Is everything all right? Does it sound like everything's all right, Oppenbot? Switch off that blasted alarm! Now! But are you quite sure that you're yourself, sir? Oppenbot! All right, all right. Which button switches off the alarm again? Could it be this one? No. That one? No. Oops. No wonder I can't focus on that terrible bracket going on. But they would notice me! The cartridge.
cartridge is in the safe. The combination is 4473. Aha! Uh -huh. 4473. Just like Gold's birthday! No, wait, wasn't that 4437? Or 4347? Yeah, who cares? Just as long as it's easy to remember. 44. Uh, something. It's similar to Gold's birthday. I feel an idea coming on. The cartridge is not in the safe. It fell behind the desk. <laughs> I may be onto something. Must have been the right button. It worked, Bailiff. Excellent. May I ask how this mishap came to pass, sir? If only I knew. I'm sure that I entered the combination correctly, as stated on the dictaphone. <laughs> and now, I'm out of here. If you don't need my services... Yes, go away. Dismissed. Cartridge is not in the safe. It fell behind the desk. Yes, wouldn't be the first time. I'd better check that right away. What was that again? I. M. N. No. Ah, wait. Darn it! How can I work with this din going on? Open bot! Why did that alarm go off again? I don't know, Bailiff. So what are you waiting for? Switch it off! One more try. What was it again? Oh yeah, Gold's birthday. Four, four, seven, three. Oh crap. Not Gold's birthday. Right. That wasn't Gold's birthday anyway. Good thing I can never remember her. <laughs> the Ascension Code. At last. Look, there's another rebel. Go get him. Uh-oh. Where did he go? Where did who go? An intruder just ran in here. Wait a moment. Hey, you, come out of there at once. Let him move on, or shall I make you? Come out of there. you definitely got to be fired. Come out of there at once. Let him move on, or shall I make you? Come out, I said. Bailiff, is that you? Uh, of course it... Of, of course it's me. Mind your own business, man. Your colleague needs help with that intruder. Very well, Bailiff.
Huh? Doc? What happened here? The place looks... Black. Deepest black. Like the color of... Oh, never mind. Say, have you been drinking? Leave him be. Tony? So, you're in command here now? Not really. Well, who then? That would be me. Dad? I mean, Seagull? That's General Seagull to you. How come you look like that? I was shot and fell into the Rust Red Sea. Then a shark came and clamped onto my leg. Luckily, a whale came and ate the shark. And me as well. I fought the shark in the whale's belly until the whale swallowed a poisonous giant octopus. And then the whale vomited up the octopus, the shark, and me into the middle of the Sea of Shards. <laughs> well, that explains your smell, but not why you're a general. Your father has a plan, Rufus. Listen to him. Unlike everything you have tried so far, it's going to work. Huh, I can barely contain my curiosity. We're going to blast Elysium out of the sky. <laughs> I'm bored already. You see, what? What? Wait a minute. You want to do what? No, you, you can't do that. Oh, yes, I can. Doc constructed this cannon here. And Tony's task force acquired an Organon Planet Destroyer. I mean, you mustn't. You can't. They don't even know we exist. And you want to let them know before they blow us to pieces? That was the plan, yes. So what are you doing here, then? Well, it's, it's complicated. Uh, right now, I'm not only here, but I'm also saving goal at the same time, while I also delay the last high boat until we're on board. It's true. He cloned himself. Oh, great. As if we didn't have enough problems. You're a monster. I'm not a monster, Rufus. I have a proposal. Go on. Astound us all with your rescue operation. But... No, no, it's all right, Tony. Let Rufus try and fail one more time. When the last high boat leaves without goal, there'll still be time to blow up Elysium. What do you say, Rufus? Do you have enough faith in yourself to agree to my proposal? Ha! <laughs> you can bet on it. That's it. Time's up. Guess that was it, wasn't it, Rufus? Just a second. The other two... What the? Ah! Ouch. Is this a bad time to drop in? Oh, contraire. We were just about to aim the cannon so we can blow Elysium out of the sky once and for all. Say what? Did you mess this up? Au contrary, Alter Ego. I explained to him that it isn't necessary because you can save gold, right? Consider it done. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm sure this is going to be an absolute highlight. You bet it is. Watch closely. This is Donna! I can see it's Donna! Where's Goal? Well, I, I, I don't have it. I don't know! And why does Donna have Goal's hair color? Hermes! <laughs> Bravo! That was even funnier than I expected. But enough, Levity. We have a paradise to shoot out of the sky. Duck! No! Stop! It's too late, Rufus. You had your chance, and you screwed up yet again. Go ahead, Doc. Aim that cannon. I'm sorry, Rufus. We don't have a choice. None of us want to die. But... Enough. Open the cannon doors. Good. Is the loading chamber closed? Oops. That almost went terribly wrong. Stop! 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 You, you really can't do that! 
Is there no one here on my side? Why are you looking at me? Why would they be? You already proved to us, rather impressively, that there are no alternatives. But there is! The third Rufus can still save the day! Hold your horses! Are you really going to leave without Goal? Goal is safe! You don't have your facts straight. Bring the girl! Goal! You're back to being yourself! But how did you get here? Where's the other Rufus? I have no idea what you're talking about! What do you mean? Who cares what's going on in that convoluted brain of his? Goal was never dead. There was actually an accident with a defective interrogation robot. But of course, we were able to save her. We threw the robot overboard. And that other woman, that Donna. But Hermes. And now that everything is settled, hand over the Ascension Codes, or your girlfriend will really be thrown from the tower. Oh crap! Her dead body was thrown from the cruiser, along with me! You appear to be suffering from hallucinations. And I mean now! Listen to me, will ya? I know that the third Rufus is still out there. So what? It can be fixed. You always say that. In your whole life, you've never fixed anything. Face it, will you? He's going to fail as well, just like you. So apologize, and then we can finally carry on. Apologize? For what? Do you really not know? Do you have no idea what you do to your friends? Again and again and again? Is this really necessary now? I think we have more important things to do. No, no, no. He needs to learn his lesson. So, Rufus, we're waiting. You're only attempting to humiliate me! Don't try to wriggle out of this one. It's time that you took responsibility for your actions. So, do it. We're waiting. All of this happened because of the way you raised me. There you go again, passing the blame. You are completely and utterly unable to learn anything at all. You will always be the same loser that you were as a child. Loser child. I'm not a loser. And I'm perfectly capable of learning. Prove it then. Go ahead. Apologize. We're waiting. I am definitely not going to apologize. Oh, yes you are. I will drag you by the ears if I have to. Do you really have to lay into him like that? We all saw it. He messed it up. So why are you being so cruel to him now? I want to hear it from him. Go ahead, Rufus. Apologize. We're waiting. We're waiting. I only wanted to help. Don't give me that. You only wanted to help yourself. I founded the Resistance, for one thing, and I'm perfectly capable of learning. No, you didn't. You just used them to impress Goal so she would take you to Elysium with her. And not even now, after you have killed her, can you admit that you failed. Will the pony really have to explode before you realize that you are harming everybody? Cut him some slack there, will ya? It's not his fault that the Organon intends to blow up Deponia. Maybe not, but having his way is obviously more important to him than preventing the destruction of the planet. That's not true at all. Prove it then! Go ahead. Apologize. We're waiting. Fine. So we wait. The third Rufus can still turn the tide. And once he's succeeded, you can apologize to me. Huh? You sickening son of a... Hey! Oh! Seagull, what are you doing? This is really going too far. Put down the weapon. Yes. Wouldn't he like that? I've had it with this little bastard leading me by the nose. I demand to hear an apology now. Loud and clear, I said now. All right, all right. I apologize. What? Why would you do that? 
trust me, we should apologize. You got something in your eye? I am beginning to lose my patience with a pair of you! With me too? But why? He's the one to blame for everything. He's got Gold's fate on his conscience. <laughs> yeah, and much more than that. He stole everything that wasn't nailed down. Hey, hands off! That's exactly what I'm talking about. He's always causing trouble. I said hands off! You see, it's all his fault. And yes, it's his fault that... That's enough! Mom died.